Hey guys, Indy here. So I am back with another Shein try on haul. Um, I'm going to just jump right in because I have not too much stuff, but quite a bit. Actually, I do have quite a bit of stuff. So I just want to jump in this video. I'm going to show you guys the first, the stuff that I'm not going to be trying on, obviously, um, because it's just miscellaneous stuff. First of all, I did get these pair of earrings off of Shein. They are rose gold. And I think they're just like a nice statement earring for when you want to dress up. And um, so yeah, and I got it rose gold because it matches my ring. My ring is rose gold. So um, yeah, I think that'll just be cute to just wear those statement earrings whenever I need to and I want to dress up and just the ring and keep it simple. The next thing that I got was this Gucci inspired snake belt. It does have the actual snake in it and the belt actually has a snake print. Now I am plus size. Um, I'm pretty sure you guys know that already. This does not fit around my natural waist where it's supposed to fit. I cannot wear this with jeans. I got it so I can wear it cinched around the top for like, you know, just like accentuate like a dress or like a fancy jean jacket or blazer because this is my these are like my hips so it doesn't fit my natural hips it fits like around my waist um so I'm gonna wear it with like a dress or to like cinch my I like to wear jean jackets or like blazers this will be used to cinch my blazers or my jean jackets so that's where I got this um so if you are plus size this is not going to fit around your natural hips it's not gonna fit to go through the hoops of your jeans if that makes sense um I'm pretty sure you could cut this the buckle out and put it on your um a different belt you could definitely do that because it does have the extra it has the little buckle part so you could take the buckle off it's still worth it. i think this was like four bucks um i will link everything that's still available down below so yeah i think this was like maybe this was like four or maybe five or six I'm not quite sure. Um, I also got this boob harness off of there. Now, I have not worn this because I forgot about it. Um, I got this a while back, but I did want to show it to you guys because I do have it. This Basically, this part goes around your boobs, and then this part goes around your neck. So it comes down, and then it goes across your boobs. I haven't worn this, but I do plan to wear this this summer, so I wanted to include this in this video because this is more of like a getting ready for summer haul so i got this harness i think it was like a dollar or a dollar 99 so let me just go get the rest of the stuff so the first item i'm gonna keep this shirt on to just show you guys these bottoms because this shirt did not come from shein but the bottoms did this is just a regular black shirt um shein does have basic tops if you guys are looking for a black shirt to match these bottoms so these are the biker shorts that I got off of there. They are like the splat highlighter green snake print. Um, I did show you guys the top that I had. They do not match. I initially bought them to go with each other. They're not the same green. The pattern's a little bit off. So the top from my other haul that I showed you guys with the highlighter, they're not the same print. They do not match. But I was able to wear these with a black tank top um yeah it's not quite summer so i'll get some wear out of these but this pair i did have from last season but i just wanted to include them they are still on their site um i wore these like with the highlighter the same highlighter green filas these match perfectly with a highlighter green filas if you guys want to get them they match perfectly um these are these shorts are now too big for me i got these last year they just don't flatter. They don't hold anything in. So definitely if you guys want them to, if you guys want your shorts to like feel like they're holding you in, you could definitely size down. Um, like I told you guys in my last video, I am smaller at the top, bigger at the bottom. So I definitely did not need the size that I got. I got a size, these are in a size 3X. I could have got a 2X. Um, just a bit better and if I wanted them super tight I could have got a 1x but I wouldn't have gotten a 1x anyways because I feel like it would probably would have showed my underwear but I definitely could have got a 2x 
these i also could have sized down these are a little bit more flattering the print is more flattering to my stomach area than the um snake print one but these i also could have sized down um to a 2x i did get a 3x but like i said these flatter my bottom area better um just maybe just because of the print so yeah i have not worn these yet I plan to i'll probably wear these with a black top also so yeah this that i am trying on is a it is a bathing suit cover up now you just wear this tight around your waist this i originally got um and it's way too big i got this in a i got this cover up in a 4x because i heard like oh if you want it to completely wrap around size up I shouldn't have and technically a 4x is considered like a size 22 but this is way too big for my waist um so I would have to like I'll show you guys I have to like bring it all the way over and tie it super tight like that for it to even close but I do like that I can technically wear it as a full skirt so if I'm going to the beach I don't have to actually wear bottoms I could just wear just this skirt cover but I just don't like that extra skirt fabric gathering around the tie so this is a made suit cover it is very long it goes all the way to your ankles it's honestly a little it goes past my ankles so i would have to kind of like bring this up onto my waist um i would have to like wear it like mid for it to be not dragging on the floor so it is very long so do not size up if you guys get this bathing suit um skirt cover um because it's not necessary I would have much rather a little bit of thigh coming out and it be a little bit smaller than it being too big because it is stretchy these bands are stretchy so you can either get true to your size or you could size down for this bathing suit cover-up okay so we are getting into our next outfit this is a complete outfit it's a two-piece um she and does have some really nice um two-piece sets that are very cheap um one thing I will say for she in is that if you are not true to size in top and bottom, like if your top doesn't match your bottom, sometimes the two pieces will not work out for you. This one kind of did. Um, the bottoms I could have gotten a smaller size. I could have gotten this in a smaller size all around. This is the bottom. They are longer biker shorts, but like I said, these, I think I got this set in a 3X. I could have got this full set in a 2X because the straps, I have them on the tightest. And it's still very loose this was supposed to be like a crop top but it kind of meets together um it doesn't suck you in so i would definitely have to wear like spanks with this um which i don't mind so this is our next piece this is also a two piece off of sheet in um this is also pretty cheap like i said their two set two piece sets are always super duper cheap i think the most that i've seen their like two piece sets is probably like 22 bucks which isn't bad at all um and that's like they're more like full blazered two piece set like their pants and their blazers but super cheap super duper um all my two piece sets that i have that i'm showing you guys in this video was less than 15 dollars for both pieces so this is the top it is a bandeau style this is a shorter style this is the skirt i do have on short underwear so that's why it's cutting right here this is it i am obsessed with this two-piece now with this two-piece um i like it and i actually did a photo shoot in this two-piece i wore like a cover-up with it but i plan to wear this again some of these pieces i have worn already i just didn't record a video but they still have them on their site so who cares when i bought them as long as i'm showing you guys now this two piece I did wear for a photo shoot. I'll show you guys the pictures of my photo shoot. I loved it. That's the only time that I did wear it. So I do want to wear this again for this summer because it's fire. So this is it. Actually, now that I have it back on, it's not too big. I don't know why it seemed big the last time I wore it. Oh, the reason why I feel like it looks too big. Okay, so this is the top. And this is the bottom. The bottom is super duper long. It goes all the way. <laughs> it goes all the way past my knees. 
the reason why this is big on me and I don't like the way it looks I could have sized down is because where where it's such such cinch down here it's kind of still like wide it doesn't cinch like I want it to so this is it So yeah, I just wish that the bottom was like a little bit small, a little bit smaller. I just wish that it was like more narrow, but I don't think, I honestly cannot say that it's because of sizing. I think maybe just the skirt is like that. And I have seen that she and skirts do flare out or they're longer than what they advertise them to be. I wanted to show you guys this top because I was obsessed with this top, but washing it, I do think that I got a stain on it. I did get a stain on it. So I got a stain on it which fucking sucks, but I am obsessed with this shirt. I love it. It does great for my boobs. It always makes my boobs look good no matter what bra I wear. It is a crop top, but it covers. Like, it's a crop top that comes down low, which is amazing. Um, I'm just obsessed with this shirt. I'm so mad that I got stains on it. So I'm probably going to buy another one. Um, either that or I'll do, like, a tie-dye effect with it so I can keep wearing this one. But I'm, I'm obsessed, and it matches my nails. So, this is it. And I know it kind of looks granny. I know, I know, I know. But this could also be sexy, sis. If you wear this, so it has like the lace detail. If you wear this with a pair of jeans and like a duster, baby girl. Okay, now I do have a bra on under this, but this does give pretty good coverage and it does hold you up. It does have padding in it. But it's not that awkward padding that's just like annoying the fuck out of you or doesn't stay in place. Um, this is a 2X. This fits true to size. So if you are a big breasted female, definitely get the 3X. Um, I could have gotten the 1X if I was wearing just this. But sometimes if I'm going to go out, I am going to wear it with a bra. I can get away with not wearing it with a bra. I have worn it without a bra. So... I could have gotten a 1X for it to fit more tight, but the 2X is perfect because I can still wear it without a bra and I can wear it with a bra without stretching out the fabric. So it's cute and it's fully banded in the back, which I love. It's not like see-through in the back. So you can legit wear it with a pair of jeans and you are Gucci. Let me tell you guys, this shirt, I don't think I'm going to try on this shirt. This shirt is very pretty. It's very nice, but it is very difficult to put on. Um, just the way it's assembled, it's very difficult to put on. But when it is, once it is on, it is cute. But one thing I will say, I shouldn't have, I should have sized up on this. This is a 2X. I should have sized up on this particular shirt. I will post what it looks like on the site. Um, I should have sized up on this because it is very short. Okay, so you guys see how it has like that crisscross. It's supposed to be off the shoulder and it's supposed to be crisscrossed over the boobs. It is very cute, but I am not about to put this shit on in this video because we will be sitting here for a half hour. The next item is... The next item. Come on, girl. Okay, so the next item is this cheetah dress it's just a plain cheetah dress um i wanted it because i can either wear it with a black duster or i can wear it with a jean jacket or i can wear it with something tied around my waist period i can wear this dress up and i can also wear this with sneakers i'm going to show you guys the length of it how fitted it is um it's pretty long um i would have to you know when you pull a dress down too far so for it to fit in the dip of my back this is without any type of Spanx. So if I had on actual Spanx, I'm pretty sure I would be sucked in much more. But I like to not wear Spanx when I'm doing... I like to not wear Spanx when I'm doing videos so you guys can see my true size and my true body shape. Um, Because I have lost a lot of weight, but I do still have the extra skin. So it's going to show when I wear my clothes. So I got some basic black high-rise bathing suit bottom. So that is them for the 360. These I got in a 1X. I wanted them to be tight. I wanted them to be fitted because I did not want to lose weight and not be able to wear these. I wanted to be able to wear these no matter what, if I lose more weight or not. These fit me perfectly. They are tight, but I wanted them to suck me in. So that's why I got them tighter. 
I'm normally a 2X on the bottom now instead of a 3X. But I got these in a 1X. I knew what I was doing when I got them in a 1X. So I know that they're tight. I understand. Of course, I got makeup on my fucking shirt. But I did put it on the day that I got it. I did wear it for a makeup video and also some pictures. So yeah, this is this. And I have seen, just from the pictures that I post, everybody's been asking me where I got this top from. I got it from Shein. Now you know, it is a mock neck. It's not a full turtleneck. It doesn't go all the way to the top, but it's not, it's like, it's a little bit higher than a mock neck. I love it because it's perfect. So if you wear a choker, it's just gonna situate, the choker is gonna situate your neck. I like the cutout. I have tattoos, so I love it even more. Um, it shows the right amount of cleavage, okay? And if you don't want your cleavage showing, just pull it up a little bit more. Have the slit be a little more close. I love the red dragon on it. And I love that it's a crop top. Y'all know I love me a crop top, okay? Big girls can wear crop tops too. Just wear high-waisted jeans, baby girl. Because you don't want your gut out. This is not a plus size top. This is a straight size top. I did tell you guys in my last video, I am smaller at the top, so I can get away with wearing straight size shirts. This is a extra large. Um, so yeah, for she and I can, I get a lot of extra large shirts just because I want them to fit. And if they're supposed to be crop top, I get an extra large because they're supposed to be fucking crop top. I don't want my shit mating my belly button. That does not mean that it's crop top. So I got this an extra large straight size. So my skinny girls, y'all can get this shirt. Big girls, you guys can get this shirt if you have a body type like mine. I do still have big arms and this fit me perfectly. Baby girl, by the end of these try on hauls, I'd be dead. A bitch be dead, okay? I'd be needing 10 glasses of the fucking wine. I'd be tired, fucking tired. Okie dokie. Now we are on to a bathing suits. The last thing I showed you guys was a bathing suit bottom. This is a full bathing suit, a two-piece. I don't give a fuck how big I am. If it covers my stomach, I'm still wearing a two-piece if I can get away with it. And I can get away with it, baby girl. I got this two-piece. This is the iconic two-piece that they have on Shein. They have it in maroon also. This, I should have gotten a 2X. I got it in a 3X. The bottom fits me good, but I still could have gotten away with get, going down in the bottom. The reason why I got a 3X overall is because I was scared that the bottom was going to be too small, but I knew the top was going to be big. But now that I have it, I could have got the 2X. So if you guys have the body type that you have a smaller top, bigger bottom, a two-piece may vary in size. Both of them may not fit as you want them to, but I like the size overall. It's a little bit big in the top area because I've lost weight in my boobs but I can still get away with wearing it it's just like if I'm in the ocean the waves are going you know baby girl but they do have adjustable straps I don't have them on the tightest so this is the top and I like this because it does have underwire it does have cups full cups I know a lot of like she and bathing suits some of them the cups don't aren't supportive and my next one I'll you guys will see but this is a full cup bathing suit So this is this is a full cheek bathing suit. It does cover. Um, yeah, I know some she and bathing suits they kind of have that cheeky look that they kind of cut where your butt is. If you don't like that, it should tell you if it's a hipster or a full like full brief. And you also can see on the models the type of bathing suit that it is. So yeah, I'm obsessed with this fucking bathing suit. And I think it's only like $13. That is the cheapest you will ever get a two-piece bathing suit. Most places you see bathing suits, you see people selling bathing suit tops and bottoms separate and they're like 20 something dollars each. Sometimes they're 30 each. I'm not paying $60 for a fucking bathing suit because me, I live on the East Coast. So we only get three months of hot weather if we're lucky. Probably two months worth of getting in the actual water. So there's no way that I'm paying sixty dollars for the bathing suit, and I like to have multiple bathing suits. So, baby girl, we want them cheap, as cheap as they can be. These bathing suit bottoms also are not full briefed. They're not high waisted because they have that cut in them. I still want to show you guys. So this is a vulnerable moment for me. I like to show you guys the full bathing suit. As you guys can see already, 
everything is cut out. So this bathing suit is cut out in the boot area. It's not as supported. You do still get a little bit of sag. So if you're a natural boob girl, it's gonna sag a little bit, but that's okay. Real boobs matter, period. This is the bathing suit. Like I said, it's not a full brief. If you pull it up, it's gonna show your stomach fat. If you pull it down, obviously it's just gonna show more of your stomach. So the last thing that I got off of Shein is not related to anything else that I got. It's not clothing related, but I'm obsessed with this. I got this bottle. It's super cute. It says my bottle. I do fresh pressed juices. It is me and my sister's business. Um, we do fresh pressed juices, but I wanted like a cute bottle to keep my juices in. It keeps me motivated drinking them, staying healthy. So I wanted a cute bottle and I saw this and I'm like, $2? Gimme. So I like it. It has a little wristlet on it. And it's super cute. It is a 18 ounce bottle to the rim. And it's just cute. So yeah, that is the end of the video. Finally, this shit's a long as fuck. But that is the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, thumbs up. If you guys wanna see more clothing hauls from me, just let me know, either more Shein or other clothing brands. I'm a small YouTuber, so, so I gotta pay for my shit, okay? So let me know where you guys want to see clothing hauls from and I will do that video for you guys. But until then, thank you guys so much for watching and make sure you subscribe if you're not already subscribed because I need you guys on my team, okay? Period. Count how many times I said period. Fuck. Um, yeah, so I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.